Wang Ying, an associate curator of the Shanghai Museum, a second-generation inheritor of the mounting and conservation for antique calligraphy work and paintings, inscribed on the representative list of Shanghai Intangible Cultural Heritage. Taught by her father, she has worked for more than 40 years, mounting and conserving more than a thousand precious Chinese calligraphies and paintings. This painting, Landscapes, inspired by Du Fu's poem, was created by Wang Yuanqi, 1642 to 1715. The image is 320 centimeters long and 91.5 centimeters wide. It is the largest painting on silk by Wang and was a gift from Wang Go, H.C. Wen, 1918 to 2020, a great-great-grandson of Wang Tonghe. 1830-1904。Chinese calligraphies and paintings are usually created on thin paper or silk, both of which are very delicate. Lots of famous paintings still exist to this day, is due to the delegation of collectors as well as the virtuosity of conservators. No mistakes are allowed when the lining is removed. Otherwise, the painting will be damaged. The conservator needs to have a calmness of mind and have steady hands. Years of practice is vital to the control of hands. Before removing the old lining, the conservators have examined the painting under a microscope. They found the silk used is different than other silk pieces. Technology reveals that the silk for this painting has 54 wefts and 72 warps in every centimeter. Based on the analysis, conservators have found the similar silk fabric in terms of waving technique, intensity, and luster. It is used for the missing parts of the painting. The image has become complete. Mounting a large silk painting may encounter a strong contraction of the fabric. For example, the painting tends to crack when it's put on a wall for flattening, which is the most difficult part. To avoid the damage, the live paper chosen for lining is essential. According to the color of the painting, conservators use traditional Chinese pigments to dye the new paper. When the paper gets dried, it will replace the old to support the image, revitalizing the whole painting. After mounting, the conservators need to put the painting on the wall and let it stay there for some time, so that the fiber of the painting can be evenly and entirely stretched in a safe degree. The techniques have been passed down for generations. Their superb skill is the source of life for these paintings, just like the gentle yet powerful live paper linings. 
thousands of ancient paintings have been dusted off to meet us. Thanks to the meticulous work of the conservators, 